All right, moving on. Heading on back to the colony. If only this thing had a turbo button, that'd be real nice. Oh look, it's the uh... It's, it's a reskinned enemy. No amount of infection could have altered a human to that extent. I wonder what is going on here. No hitting the colonists, even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. As you order, Commander Shepard. Priorities. Gareth, stop getting in my way, please. You know, I have a distinct memory of playing this once and I completely forget to switch out the grenades. So I just blowing people, I just blew people up on accident. Oh, hello. Please don't do that. Oh, thank God, but I say I'm, I'm on grenades. Ugh. Oh, I got some of them ragdolls, gross. <laughs> Oh, come on. What do I have the force? What is this? To fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trust me. It wants me to stop you, but I won't. I won't! Okay, well we're down to 15 colonists now, aren't we? What do we want to put like our, our helmets on to try and prevent any spore inhalation? That would be the wise thing, wouldn't it? Oh, 
Oh yeah, I'm full Paragon. Hell yeah, baby. All right, we just need to find this creature. Look at that fucking what, thing. What it? That is disturbing. That does not look like any plan I've ever seen. This may be problematic. Is it breathing? What is this Cthulhu monster going on here? Invaders. Your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh barely given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no yeah, more. I, I fuck off. I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them now. No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Your blood will feed the ground in a new growth. Thank you, Liara. Where do I go? There we are. Yeah, don't throw up on me, buddy. Hang on, hang on, we leveled up, hang on. It's a plan. How's it making noise? That had the desired effect, I believe. A few more and it will be severely hurt. Oh, another one, really? You ain't shit, bitch. I'm not afraid of you. Oh, nope, she's knocking me down. And there she goes again. Where is this next growth at, huh? She's back. Oh, don't you dare hit me.
Okay, there's one more, I believe. Don't quote me on that. Could you guys, like, not? Okay, now I believe there's one more. Oh, nope, she got me. Where's it at? Oh, it's not right there. It is. That thing has to stop. Nope, still don't got all of them yet. God damn it. This woman's shooting me. Please. There we go. Now we should have a clean shot straight to the uh, the last node. He said, hopefully. Nope. There's more. Oh no. There we go. Got them all. I'm free. I I suppose I should thank you for releasing Who the hell are you? Is everything all right? Are you hurt? I am fine. Or I will be. In time. My name is Shiala. I serve... I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. We already know what happened. Are you saying Saren can control minds? Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. Benezia sought to turn the river and was swept away. A sorry matriarch. Yeah, we already know how it happens. This fucking ship. Beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel. An enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. 
It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Yeah, that's not cool. Saren's pretty quick to betray his own people. He was quick to betray the Thorian, too. After he had what he wanted, he ordered the Geth to destroy all evidence of his existence. Saren knows you are searching for the conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the cipher. Yeah, what is that? Give me context, please. What's the cipher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. He must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. So it just kind of knows how they how they work. So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The cipher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. A viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught. It simply exists. Yeah, did Liara say that the merging is like a... Or melding is like a very... I need that knowledge. Significant event for us, sorry. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Oh, that's my phone vibrating for. Physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe. Embrace eternity. That was totally not enlightening. I have given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. Are you all right? What just happened? Yeah, hell if I know. I saw something. It still didn't make any sense. You have been given a great gift, the experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. We should get you back to the ship where you can be monitored. I am sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. Do you know what the conduit is? Or where it is? No, I'm sorry. All I know is that Saren believes the conduit was the key to the proceeds. Well, we know where it is, don't we? No. Then whatever it is, we can't let him have it. You have the cipher. In time, your visions will clear. They will lead you to the conduit. I only pray you find it before Saren does. Is there anything else you can tell me about the Thorian? When the creature enveloped me, I became part of it. But I still don't truly understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It was a Lovecraftian horror. That's different. all you need to know. Ten thousand years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. 
It transcended all classification. And now it is gone. Don't tell me you feel sorry for that thing. The Thorin was a unique life form. A sentient being that lived for 50,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. I am grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the loss of such a rare and remarkable creature. Alright, what do you know about Saren? Can you tell me more about what him? What else can you tell me about Saren? There is little I could tell you that you do not already know. He's powerful, he's charismatic. And he is dangerous. Once I followed him, blind to his true nature. But now I see he is leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. I want to know more about you. There is nothing remarkable about me. I was merely one of Matriarch Benezia's disciples. For nearly two centuries I followed her, learning at her feet. When Benezia revealed her plan to join Saren, she gave her disciples a choice. Only those who were willing had to follow her. Many felt her plan was too dangerous. But I believed in her. I thought she could turn Saren away from his insanity. Instead, we joined him in it. Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? Just leave her be. She's not going to hurt anyone. It, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. Yeah, you can do that. You're fine. All the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. You're not my enemy now. I'm not going to pick fights. I don't I can't need to do. Believe it. Jong says we'll have all the money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you enough. Ships are already on their way here with supplies. I fought so hard, but any thought of my own caused so much. Where's our Solarian friend? He, oh, there he is. Where were you? I never thought I would be so thrilled to see a soldier. Forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's influence, every thought was examined, filtered. Let me see what you have in stock. Of course. Return in the future, and I may even have more to see. The above shit. Look at all that money I have. I have the, nag the nagging suspicion that I won't be like hurting for cash anytime soon. Alright, back to the Normandy so we can get off this goddamn island. Wait, this goddamn planet. And we can get ready for Vermeer, because that's next on the list. But first we gotta do a bunch of well, not a bunch, but a couple of side missions. But that'll be a job for next session because as soon as we're done with the, uh, the team meeting and the checkup with the council, I'm going to bed. Thank you, Joker, for not abandoning me. I really do appreciate that. Decontamination in progress. 
Commander, you look pale. Are you suffering any ill effects from the cipher? I mean, I did just get like a whole bunch of information just dumped in my head all at once, so I mean. The cipher shook me up. I'm sure it had some kind of lingering effects. I might be able to help you. I am an expert on the Protheans. If I join my consciousness to yours, maybe we can make some sense of it. Do it. Hurry. We don't have much time. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. Let's see it all over again. Yay. That was incredible. All this time, all my research, yet I I never dreamed. I am sorry. The images were so vivid. I never imagined the experience would be so intense. You are remarkably strong-willed, Commander. What you have been through, what you have seen, would have destroyed a lesser mind. Okay, save the flattering for later, Come on, please. Get to the point. What did you see? The beacon on Eden Prime must have been badly damaged. Large parts of the vision are are missing. The data transferred into the Commander's mind is incomplete. You sure you didn't come across any kind of clue or hint? Something we might have missed? Everything I saw, you already know. You were right about the Reapers. The Protheans were destroyed by a race of sentient machines. I think it is obvious there is a connection between the Reapers, the Prothean extinction, and the Conduit. But I did not see anything that would help us find oh, it. Oh, well now we go to Vermeer. What's our next move? I was able to interpret the data relayed through your vision. What was there, at least. But something was missing. Saren must have the missing information. Maybe he found another beacon. If we can find the missing data from your vision, I can... I can... Oh, I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. How do you take this shit worse than I do? Dr. Chakwas should take a look at you. That will not be necessary. I just need some rest. Somewhere quiet. We're done here. Dismissed. I've sent off the Pharos report, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Yeah, let's talk to these Charter. assholes again. Setting up the link now, Commander. Commander, Exogeny should have told us about the Thorian. It would have made your job much easier. You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying it. No, 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 no keeping it alive. Mines. Anyone who studied it would have ended up as one of its thralls. Perhaps it's for the best, then. At least the colony was saved. Of course it was saved. Shepard would go to any lengths to help a human colony. Being human had nothing to do with it. They were in trouble. Admirable. But sometimes specters have to make sacrifices. I hope you're willing to do that when the time comes. Goodbye, Commander. We will be waiting for your next report. Oh, I hate these. I hate them so much. <laughs> They're so not helpful, like at all. All right, well, well, hang on. Don't know when I got that, but put a point in there real quick. Okay, journal, assignments. Okay, we need to go do this one. We need to do that. Wait, where did this one come up? All right, we'll we'll do that one too. Okay, so when we come back, we're gonna do these three, these three assignments, and then we'll go on to do Vermeer. But until then, time to save. All right, guys, we're gonna call it call it a session right there. I feel like we did a decent amount in this session. I mean, we took care of an entire planet, so that's a win in its own right. Uh, it is currently 3.30 in the morning. I am I am very tired, so I'm going to go ahead and head on up to bed. I hope you guys are enjoying the playthrough. Because I know I am. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys join me for the rest of the playthrough. For the rest of the game. And until then... Hope you guys have a great day, have a great night, 
and I'll see you guys when we come back for more. Bye-bye.